Kim Gitaek used to work as a driver, but he lost his job long ago and now ekes out a miserable existence with his wife Chun Sook and two graduating age children in a basement apartment. The family tries to make ends meet by making pizza boxes out of cardboard. One day, Gitaek's son Ki Wu is visited by his friend Min Hayuk, who works as an English tutor for a girl from a rich family. Min Hyuk goes to study abroad and invites Ki Wu to take his place, since he has been improving his English for the past four years in order to enter college, and gives Ki Wu a contemplation stone, which is supposed to bring wealth to the family. Ki Wu has an interview at the Park family's extremely luxurious and spacious mansion. He makes a good impression on Mrs. Park and gets the job. As he leaves the house, he notices a painting of the pack's youngest son on the wall. Under the pretext that the boy's artistic potential should be developed, he offers to hire an acquaintance named Jessica, who, according to him, studied at an art school in the United States, but in fact is his sister Ki Jung as an art mentor. After Ki Jung is hired into the Park household as an art tutor for the Park's young son Ta Sung, she arranges everything to fire the Park's driver and replace him with her father, G.I. Taik. After Gite gets a job, he manages to find a job for his wife Chun Sook the Kims arranged the dismissal of housekeeper Moon Guan by passing off her peach skin allergy as tuberculosis. One day the packs go on a trip to the countryside. Gitaek and his family take this opportunity to celebrate their success in fooling their hosts and drink expensive wine from the family cellar. Suddenly, former housekeeper Moon Guang appears, saying that she has come to pick up her things. In fact, she came to her husband Yun Se, who is hiding from creditors in the basement of the house. Out of strange respect for his secret benefactor, Mr. Park, he works as a motion sensor manually turning on the lights on the stairs when people come down them. When Moon Guan and her husband discover the truth about the Kim family, a fight breaks out. Gi Taek and his family win by locking the couple in the basement Moon Guan is seriously wounded in this case. Mrs. Park calls Chun Suk to tell her to prepare food because of the rain. The owners return before reaching their destination and will be home in a few minutes. Ki Taik, Ki Jung, and Ki Wu, who were not supposed to be in the house, hide and are almost discovered several times, but finally manage to escape unnoticed. They then run home in the pouring rain and return to their poor neighborhood to find their basement apartment flooded. Ki Wu wanders around the apartment to find the large stone given to him at the beginning of the film. Ki Wu, Ki Jong, and Ki Tai Tak are sleeping in a school where a shelter has been set up for flood victims. The next day, Mrs. Park, unaware of the family's problems, plans to throw a party for her son's birthday and invites the entire Kim family to take part in the celebration. Ki Wu, who feels responsible for the entire chain of events, goes down to the bunker, carrying with him a large talisman stone. He discovers that the former housekeeper has died from her wounds. Jun Se attacks Ki Wu. He manages to get out of the basement and stun Ki Wu with a stone blow. He takes a knife, searches for the Kims in the small crowd and tries to stab them. In the confusion, he strikes at the rich guests as they block his passage. He mortally wounds Ki Chong. The son of the parks loses consciousness when he sees the ghost chasing him. Jun Sai then attacks Chun Suk. Ki Taik, grieving over the body of his dying daughter, prepares to help his wife, while Mr. 
Park tries to escape with his unconscious son, yelling at G.I. Taik to throw him the car keys. Chun Suk manages to kill Gyun Si. Turning over the corpse to pick up the car keys that G.I. Taik had thrown, Park pinches his nose to show that Gyun Se smells bad. Gitiek, who had previously overheard Park discussing him and describing his smell as disgusting, becomes enraged and stabs Park, killing him. Gitiek runs away, hides in the basement, and eventually takes Gyun Se's former place, becoming a motion sensor for the next families to settle in the estate. The film ends with an exchange of messages between Gitek and Ki Wu. Ki Wu promises that one day he will make money and buy the house. He dreams of walking around the house with a real estate agent. In reality, the film ends with Ki Wu sitting in his poor house and Gitek still hiding in the basement of the mansion.